Hi everyone, it's Lara from She Shepherd. Uh, so uh, today, here are the girls. We are going to bring the ewes back from the wintering to get them scanned, which means that we're going to see if they're in lamb or not, and if they are in lamb, how many lambs they are carrying. So, uh, yeah, I've just been gathering them all from all the different fields around here. I'll just show you quickly. Sorry. And um, and I will get them onto a path that's at the top over there, and then um, we'll pass the road, and hopefully I'll do some uh, drone shootage because I actually forgot the memory card of my good camera. Uh, so um, so yeah, and Sabine is gonna hold the road at the bottom, so that's gonna be very fun, hopefully. Let's go. Stand. Stand there. Stand. 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 Stand there. Come on, girls. Stand there. Stand. Stand. Okay, Sabine, on arrive. Just speaking French to Sabine.
So to get the operation going smoothly, we're going to put the use in a smaller pen and then in one even smaller and then for the race like this and someone is going to be pushing the sheep up it's uh, a that you can see on the sides and then they will be climbing up into a trailer where the sheep scanner will be working from so it's um nearly quarter past seven or something and uh is the scanner is going really really fast uh now i'm just checking the condition of my sheep they are super fat. So the scanning is really important because the sheep scanner is going to be able to tell us if the ewe is in lamb or not. And uh, if she's in lamb, how many lambs she's carrying. Also, it will be able to tell us if uh, we have any that are kind of late or maybe some ewes that are a bit early. It's really important because it will be crucial for the management of the flock. Knowing that some sheep will have lots of lambs, we'll need to give them a lot of attention, to feed them right, to enable them to raise their lamb properly, but also to keep it healthy while it's inside. And uh, the ones that are not in lamb will need to... Uh, to get an idea of who they are, if they had a lamb last year or if not, and if they're young or older sheep and we'll have to make a decision just to keep a flock healthy, young and prolific. So as you can see the job is going really fast with all the usual helpers, that are, uh, the dogs <laughs> including. Yeah, it's quite fun, but it's also quite stressful because the scanning, everything is going to depend on it. So after a year of work, if the scanning is bad, then it's pretty depressing. But if the scanning is good, then it's really rewarding as well. Okay. So here is the last lot to scan. So there are the chibi mules, there are around 70 of them and there is a couple of blue faced I'm just using Zorog to get them in the shade Steady Steady Oi. Steady Don't panic girls, stand Just going in themselves, which is handy. Hello, Zark. Hello, boy. So here we've got Andy Stexel, like a beautiful pedigree one in here. So finger crossed, they are gonna have a good scanning as well. So here we have the Chibit mules. Hello, pretty girl. So out of Chivit U and um, and a blue face Lester. There's some texture across from uh, the very start. So for, from when I started my flock, I was um, just taking some of the wee lots, which has been a really nice view um, so far. But yeah, finger cross. Yeah, that's the end of the Texan right here. I can see that there was already quite a few triplets so hopefully I won't have too many triplets because I don't really like it so the end result of the scanning is pretty good the North Country Tribute are at 159% which is more than what we got last year and it's pretty good because Tribute are not the most prolific so I'm personally very happy with that the textiles uh, that are more prolific, they were at 169%. The chivid mules were at 199%, which I'm really pleased with because it's more than last year and uh, we don't have many triplets. 
too many triplets means that we're just going to have more pets. So in total, out of 500, we have only 20 free triplets but we also have a quad so one of the four blue face lester got four little lambs in her belly so that's going to be some fun so all that gives us a total of 165 percent so that's pretty exciting we also have two hogs in lamb of a single lamb it wasn't meant to happen, but I top paid a little visit to a little group of training sheep. So here we are with another two on the list. I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, see you next time. No, I think you're a double. <laughs> <laughs> My question was, are they beautiful? <laughs>